My favorite tool is the wrench, obviously. They have this really great feature. Yes, very interesting. Please tell me, oh my god. You can actually see that it's actually just a hologram of Sonya right there, although I feel like it would have been funny if it was like a cardboard cutout with like a tape recorder taped to her back. Really? That's awesome. Sammy and Max never want to listen to me go on about tools. They say it puts them to sleep. You are so funny, Andy. Where did you learn so much about tools? Well, I grew up around my tools. My parents fixed up old junkers, so me and my sisters all learned. Of course, of course. What about your friends? <laughs> well, Sammy doesn't let me touch the good tools, and Axe just holds them above my head. <laughs> Fascinating. Tell me, what beep. Recording powering down. Uh -huh. huh? Uh, wait, what are you saying? I'm sorry to have kept you waiting. Shall we begin our battle now? My god, Andy, you are comically dumb. I forgot how dumb Andy is in the original Advance Wars. I'm starting to think you might have been lying about those new tools. I swear, you know what? I said before that Veronica Taylor is like a good voice for Andy in this game. This just cemented because we both know that for a fact that Ash and Andy both share one half of the singular brain cell that they uh, between them. Andy stops talking to, stops tooling around and takes on Sonya's last test. Oh my god. So wait, was Andy just standing there talking to a hologram for like hours on end, just talking to her about tools? I'm gonna say so. Sonya's goal. The goal? To get away from Andy and his constant talk about tools. Why do we have to battle, Sonya? I thought we were getting along pretty well. That was just a recording of my voice, Andy. To keep you distracted. Now, let's begin your test. I'm not so great at tests. Nell says it's my poor attention span. How did this boy get through basic training? I ask you. Uh, oh, for that. It's not that kind of test, Andy. Oh. Well, I'm not going to share my great facts about wrenches now. Let's do this. Okay. Okay. Andy may be comically dumb, but he... He's enjoyably comically dumb. Alright. So, of course, another Falk of War mission. We have to either take out all of Sonya's units or capture her HQ. I don't like the fact that there's all this wooded area. This just screams, I'm laying waiting to ambush for your entire army. So, what I think I'm going to do, because there's a road that leads up to it... I think I'm gonna try and sneak my army up this way. We'll probably leave like a soldier behind to like guard HQ just in case like trouble comes a knocking. But for the most part, I think what I'm going to do is just like try to get my troops all the way up around and up to her HQ. All right, lander's loaded. Let's send the battleship up here. Oh, <laughs> it's a good thing I put the battleship in the wreath. Oh, it was really good that I put the battleship there. Uh, I guess we can focus on taking out the submarine first. I know we're going to be taking a pretty big hit with that, that rocket. Get you guys all stationed here. I'll have the missile sit right here for now. I'll put the lander inside the reef just to keep it safe for a bit. Move you down here, and we'll put you in an APC. And we'll get our transport over here. Okay, cool. If anything tries to attack the transport, it'll be shut down by the missiles or the anti-air. Rockets basically have the main road covered, and the recon is just, well, having a beach day. Show me what you can do. 
Here's your last test, Indy. Uh-oh. Okay, you're attacking the sub? Uh, all right. Okay, I think I heard a fighter. I know there's a couple helicopters, but I think she might have a fighter on patrol around there, so I need to be careful with my air units. First and foremost, let's take care of those rockets sitting right there. Actually... Okay, that bay right there is completely clear. I should not have done that. Okay, the beach is completely covered. I need to wait a little bit. She's got a soldier up there. She's got a bomber on approach. Oh, dear. Those are all completely covered, so I'm going to guess her bomber's probably going to try and make its way down to the main army. Uh-oh. What a pleasant surprise. As an opponent, Andy's not half bad. I beg to differ. Enhanced vision. All right. Probably should have just dived there just to keep the sub safe. But I'm going to bet you anything that that bomber is going to target the sub. I'll honestly be shocked if it decides to attack the cruiser or the battleship. I hear those helicopters. Uh oh, yeah, it's going after the sub. But thankfully, it's the subs in the reef, so it's somewhat safe. Hard but that uh, doesn't really matter if it's safe or not because it's already been sunk. Uh, let's focus on taking out those tanks first and foremost. Yeah, I think I'm going to focus on taking out the tank, so... Uh... Now, honestly, the art uh, the rockets aren't really going to do that much damage because they're vastly weakened. And I'd rather just, like, soften up the landing zone for the attack force. I think what I'll send over next is probably the APC and the light tank, and then I'll get the recon as well. I'm going to see if I can actually try and get the T-copter at least up to this forest line, and maybe just drop off the infantry up there to keep them safe, and then I can slowly start uh, bringing another infantry squad up, maybe the max. Oh, well, there's your Battlecopter. I'm kind of surprised that it, it didn't count as an ambush for my cruiser. I almost keep calling them frigates because my mind is on Battalion Wars. Oh, she's got a battleship! Oh, and a cruiser as well. Man, she's just absolutely prepared for everything, although her cruiser's kind of 
useless. Nothing's in range, unfortunately. We can damage this guy. And I probably should have used Hyper Repair first before we attacked. Uh, it's at times like this I wish I had a fighter with me. That is such an ash line. Hyper repair. I really should have probably started the round off with this. Same amount of damage. Yeah, these are the weaker battle copters, so let's just focus on trying to take these guys out first. And that hardly did anything. Uh, rockets? Mm, yeah. And even then, they, they still knock it down by 1 HP. They're probably going to try to swarm the missiles, if I were to guess. Oh, she's got a tank coming this way. It's probably a good thing to get the tanks there, then. And I'm going to guess the tanks are probably going to attack the anti-air inside the city. need this thing to harass my copters. Man, already got her CO power back. I see right through your plans. That's a good thing to it oh wait no that's infantry in there. I got the max. Which means that infantry is probably gonna try to stop them. Oh yeah, I forgot about these guys. Oh, and the battleship can target there as well? Gross. Oh great, now it's trapped. Though I think one might be in range of the missiles, so I can at least hopefully free it. No, I can't. Ah, damn sunk.
Okay, cool. I can't free it. This is unfortunate. I really don't have a good counter for that bomber right now, so I just need to hustle my infantry over to that HQ already. I don't want to put the battleship right there just yet because that bomber will see it. So we're just going to have to hope. I'm going to bet you anything the bomber's probably going to try to go for the mediums that are sitting right there. You fool. Oh, hey, I think that's the first time we've seen the Orange Star HQ. That looks pretty good. Ugh, just barely held in there. But now I think you're definitely in range of that... Oh, great, I just realized that the bomber now sees the battleship. Now in range of the missiles, so I can at least take out those helicopters. should take out those tanks. Almost. No, that's not going to be enough. Hoping that HQ is completely unguarded. We'll see in just a second. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Tank ambush. Uh, the worst place for it to be. Oh, there goes the air transport. I will be absolutely amazed if she does not just shoot that thing down next turn. Yep, it, there goes our transport. Great. And there goes our fast means of ground transportation. Okay, we got a problem. We got a serious problem.
Okay, hopefully the Battlecopter will be able to harass that enough. I guess another way, we probably could have tried to sneak, uh, like, a small strike team through here using the reefs. Now that I see, you could sort of, like, bunny hop your way from reef to reef till you got to here, but then again, you kind of would come under ambush from all sides. Hmm. Okay, let's do this. I'm gonna hide you guys here because you can go further. I'm unfortunately got to sacrifice the mechs, but if the now the bomber is gonna be out of range because it's just gonna attack them right there. I should have just kept them where they were and then just ambushed the bomber when it came in. Damn it! Actually, no, that wouldn't even matter because the bomber still would have been out of range because it would if it attacked the city. Thankfully, the tanks are so weak they can't even damage my copters. But that fighter squadron can! Ooh, did you? Did you actually do something stupid? Please tell me you did something very stupid. Yes, you did! And you're supposed to be a tactical genius, Sonya. That might be the last of her navy. Hmm. All right, idea. Well, I can't do anything about those fighters, but they're kind of only good for reconning right now. I think what I'll do is I'll get the medium tank up there, I'll protect their HQ with the medium tank while I slowly start making my infantry head up here. I'll slowly move these guys up here. If I can get the mechs up there, great. If not, then I'm going to put the infantry inside the lander and we're just going to reef hop our way over to the HQ and we'll just see which one gets to it first. And hopefully in one piece. Number of enemy troops. Location. Got it. Enhanced vision. I'm just wondering what she's going to use to attack. She knows where my troops are now, but at the same time, I don't think she has anything that she can really uh, strike with. Yeah, she doesn't have any, like, long-range units, no bombers, no nothing. So I don't even know why she just wasted her CO power like that. Oh, there's the fighter. Why they somewhat walked right into an ambush. Alright, this site seems clear, so let's head on up.
I doubt they're even gonna try to attack my tanks. They're probably gonna retreat back to their HQ. It's just the tanks. I got scared for a second. Tactical genius, everybody. Clear over there. And it looks pretty clear. Yeah, I think all she has left is her fighter squadron. And I'm gonna guess, like, her ground forces down here, but she's not gonna try and move them for whatever reason. Tells me that my ground force, my lander is gonna get there before my mechs do. All right, that's clear. It might just be, like when the camera shifts down there. I think that might just be her troops desperately trying to make their way through all the forest just to get up to here. That's basically covered. Yep, I heard tank moving. All right, no more recon. Till next turn before we use hyper repair just in case her tank attacks. Oh, what? Oh, rockets! Well, it's a good thing it dropped off the troops when it did. I'm gonna guess that her rockets are probably right here if it, they were able to attack the lander like that. Why you may ask, well, I'm using Hyper Repair when we basically got this one. Well, well, I'm a Warmonger and I want to get that power bonus. So of course those tanks have to die. Also, I just like this remix uh, when we use Andy's power, so of course they have to play it. Oh wow, I actually never noticed it, but you can see the HQ in the background if it's like right next to where a battle takes place. I never noticed it. That's really awesome. I know the same thing happened like when you had like a city next to it in the original, but that's actually cool that they put the, the HQs in there as well. <laughs> Angry Sammy noises are what I live for. All right, Sonya, it's time for some answers. Why have you been attacking us? I will be revealed in due time, Sammy. But first, Andy's assessment. Uh... My what now? You don't have any weak points. Lies, lies. This boy has many weak points. Whoa. I knew it, I'm amazing. But you don't have any special strengths either. <laughs> huh? However, that in itself is your special strength, so you just contradicted yourself. It's quite simple. You just keep moving, and then you repair the mistakes you make. 
You know, things get rough, Max and Sammy show up to help you out. Of course, that's the key I was missing. Oh, come on! Hey, don't you ignore me. No. Sammy, very soon you and your friends are going to face a foe of an unimaginable ferocity. Take care of each other and prepare for rough seas ahead. How do you know this? That's not your concern, nor is it something I can reveal. Just heed my warning. It was good to see you again, Sammy. What? <laughs> like I said, I live for angry Sammy. Wait, wait, Sonya! Hey, where are you going? She's gone again. And you know what the worst part of all? If this is about those tools again, I'm gonna thump you. <laughs> hey, what I miss? Those new tools. Oh my god, Andy. Ugh, speed could have been a lot better. Technique as well, but I'd blame that bomber that basically wiped out the army for the most part. 